massive trip coming up soon and we are in the process of getting the car ready. We're absolutely going flat stick at the moment trying to get this car ready. So um, yeah, we're just going to take you guys with us on our, um, on our adventures of trying to get the car ready. We are definitely getting ourselves ready. Um, yeah, we're not usually this gross in here, but we're getting all our comfort box ready to go. Where are we going, Wolf? Uh, bunnies. Okay, uh, okay, I'm gonna ask again. Is it this time you're gonna go, we're going to Alice? Oh, well, no, because we're going to bunnies now. Oh boy. That's where we're going. We're going to Bunnings. So, where are we going on our trip? We're going to Alice. We're going to Alice! Well, not just Alice. We're going to all... Where are we heading to today? Oh shit. Our Bunnings. Then to Aussie Pooch. Let's get the food for the food. Then possibly Anaconda. Maybe. Maybe not. So what, what's from Anaconda? Uh, Camelbacks. For when we do our walks. Interesting. Oh, just stressing yourself there, bud. Huh? You're dressing yourself. Thanks. So I've got my packing list. Is this so Packing list. So this is all the stuff that we're taking. Uh, this is just in the car. And then we have a couple of boxes that we put in. So we've got the comfort box, which has anything that will make things a little bit nicer, like, um, you know, air guard. Um, you know, dishwashing liquid, rubber mats, um, bed sheet, the tarp, and then we have our kitchen box. So our kitchen box has anything and everything we need to make food. So our chopping board, utensils, aluminum foil, cunt mugs. Cunt mugs. Say foil again. You said what are you like, trying to say? You said it like an American. I know I did. Aluminium. I know I did. <laughs> Aluminium. I know, I know I did because I'm taking the piss out of it, bros. And this car is going to be back in a sec. I don't have my thick ball on. Hit that motherfucking. Turn that off now. Um, so we're off to Bunnings now to get oh, a couple of extra brackets for our... Um, our king's awning because uh, it's only being attached by the first few like the first like meter and a half and it's two and a half meters long so the back's just kind of like flapping around back there but all right well, that's cool too <laughs> we are five days away from departure so just a quick update we've got the king's awning on i've mounted up some brackets one goes there, comes out here, supports the back. The other one comes off there, comes up, supports the middle. Put some insulations in our AOS thing. About to paint the Isuzu grill black. So I just sprayed, uh, just sanded the front grill. Now about to tape it up and paint it. Here is the new painted grill. Not too bad. Just a quick, easy job. These are the L brackets that we added, cut to size, and now painted. One there, one there. Tomorrow we'll be heading from there to Alice 
and see where this road trip takes us. <laughs> Alright, I bought a, a tub of lollipops and good old Wallace here wanted a, an apple chop a chop. Apple's the best. But downside was there was only one in the container and it was right down the bottom so I tipped all the um, all the chopper chops out but I can repurpose this into a rubbish bin so I'm currently I've got my little Stanley knife and I'm currently cutting a hole in the top so it'll just be like I can like push stuff in without actually taking this off so Always using safe practices when using a knife. My sticky. That's my little bin. Alright, we just left Catherine and we just booked in uh, through Petters at Alice Springs to get our uh, new constant load leaf springs, which pretty exciting. What do you reckon? Yes, we definitely need them. Our current springs are inverted. <laughs> They're not supposed to go that way. Oh, uh, yeah. That was like a last, very, very last minute mod to the car that we've been trying to organise between Darwin and Catherine, which is, you know, for me. <laughs> yeah, it's not ideal when your shops are pretty much bottoming out. While driving straight. Yeah. With no bumps. See the turn off and the end point. Keep. How many kilometers has it been? Um, not many, but we left like, it's like 600. 600 kilometers. It's now six o'clock. <laughs> oh my god! That was best timing ever. Our original plan was to go in and have a beer and go back to the campsite to cook some dinner, but after coming off night shift, we were beat. So we just had dinner at the pub and just watched the entertainment. Next episode, we're going to drive from Daily Waters to Matt's Quarry, which is a little free camp about three hours north of Alice. So, see you next time.